Welcome back to the game plane. We're still in the air, which means we still have cash and prizes to give away. We're ready for our next game. It's Checklist Challenge. I need two players. I need whoever's got the seven of diamonds. There she is. All right. And we've got the queen of clubs. All right. Excellent. Come on up. Well, you guys made it to the game row. Congratulations. Thank, Thank you, you very much. We're Let's excited. meet you. What's your name? Irma Bennett. Irma Bennett from where? Waikiki. And what do you do at Waikiki? Um, I'm a network marketer professional. <laughs> As opposed to those amateur hobby network <laughs> marketers. Good luck to you. And what's Thank your name? You. My name's Andrew Hill. Andrew Hill, and where's home for you? Uh, Las Vegas. What do you do for a living? Uh, musician, producer. What kind of music do you play? We do a show in Hawaii called The Forever Fab. It's a Beatles show. So you're like a Beatles tribute band? Yep. And who do you play? Paul. You're Paul. Mm. Oh, come on. I know. You're living the dream. Excellent. Now we're going to play this game called Checklist Challenge. So I'm going to read a question to you guys. Actually, it's a list, and there's a whole bunch of answers on the list. You're going to take turns bidding how many of those answers you think you can get right. And if you get them right, you're going to get a point. And if you get them wrong, your opponent's going to get a point. First one to get the best two out of three is going to win a fantastic prize I'll tell you about. Cool. Irma, you'll bid first, okay. okay? So here's the question. According to McDonald's online menu, many food and beverage items begin with the letters MC. For example, the McDouble is one of them. There are eight remaining foods besides the McDouble that start with an MC. How many of them can you name? Two. She says two. Can you beat that? Let's see. Three. Three? Can you name four? Four. Can you name five? Five. Challenge. Oh, really? Wow, she's yeah, throwing it down. I know. Yeah. Remember, she's a professional network marketer. Okay. <laughs> All right, you've got to name five of these MC items off a of McDonald's menu, and if you can do that, you get the first point. We gave you McDouble. That doesn't count, so name five others. Ready? Uh, McChicken. That's one. Uh, McCrispy. McCrispy sounds delicious, but it's not on the menu. I'm sorry. No point for you. That means you no get the point, Irma. All right. First one yeah. goes to you. All right. The answers were McCafe, which is their coffee thing that's on the menu. McChicken. We all know that. McFlurry. Yummy. McGriddle. I never am up early enough to get breakfast. Okay. McMuffin. Also there. Right. McNuggets. Classic. Classic. McRib. Seasonal. McRap. Never heard of it. <laughs> All right, Irma bid first. This time you get to bid first. Okay. First point goes to Irma. Okay. If she gets this one, she wins the prize. If not, we'll have that third question. During the American Civil War, we asked the British guy. We had, it was like intramural. We I did know, that at guys, home. It was fine. During the American Civil War, 11 states seceded from the Union to form the Confederacy. How many of those southern states can you name? Four. Jumping up to four. Can you name five? From the Confederacy. I challenge you. Wow. She's mean. All right, if you get four, you get the second point, and then we'll go to the third match. Uh, Georgia. Georgia is number one. Um, Louisiana. Louisiana was there. That's two. Two more. Mm. Texas. Texas is there. Three. One more. You've got this. Uh, the last one would be... Alabama. Alabama is a fourth state. That is right. Congratulations. Yay! Second point goes to you. Good one job. and one. By the way, Alabama, Arkansas, Florida, Georgia, Louisiana, Mississippi, North Carolina, South Carolina, Tennessee, Texas, and Virginia. But not West Virginia. West Virginia became West Virginia because they didn't want to be part of the Confederacy and broke off, and that's when we got that state. All right. Back to you, Irma. You're going to bid on this one. This is going to decide the game. According to InfoScan reviews, Bud Light is the top selling beer in the US. They can be domestic or imports, but they're top sellers in the US. How many of the nine remaining beers can you name, Irma? Uh, I say three. Three. Andrew? Four. Irma? He can name four. I'll say five. I'll challenge you. You're challenged. Uh, you're if you challenged. can name gotcha. five beers that made the top list of U.S. selling beers, you're going to win our game and win a prize I'll tell you about. I, I, I'm just taking a wild guess. Uh, Coors Light? Yes. That's one. Okay. Four more, you've got it. A, a Blue Ribbon something? Blue Ribbon or Paps Blue Ribbon? Yep. That's not on the list. I'm sorry about yes. that, Irma. That means yes. that Andrew has won our game. Congratulations. <laughs> the beer's on the list. Bud Light being number one, Coors Light you got, Budweiser, oh. Miller Light, Corona, Natural Light, Bush Light, Michelob Ultra Light, Bush, 
And then we've got an import. Heineken made the list as well. But congratulations Excellent. to you. Two out of three goes to you, Good Andrew. Job. Guess what? You've won a prize. You've just won a $500 gift Woo! card to Whoa. Beyond the Rack. Beyond the Rack, North America's premier members-only online shopping club, offering luggage, tablets, top designer brand clothing, beauty and home decor, at up to 80% off retail prices. Yeah. Andrew, thanks for playing the game. Now, we've given you a gift card. Yes. And while I can't let you sing any of those songs because we're on TV, exactly. can you talk like Paul for us? I can talk like Paul Why if you want me to talk like Paul. Why don't you have Paul McCartney send us to commercial? We're going to be right back with the game playing. Wow, I feel like I'm in Liverpool. There you go. It's awesome. <laughs>